Hello, hello everybody. Today I'm going to start with tapping and scratching sound. I guess a lot of kind of crinkling sound. Um, we have all these presents. Now it's a little late for a Christmas time present thing, but hey potato. And then well tapping and scratching was a request. Hey Jonathan. And then we'll do a little bit of this at the end. So let's get started with the scratching. So this was a part of a white elephant thing, you know, where like you trade off gifts to each other. Not really sure how we ended up with the, yeah, this is a tempera guide. sure what's going on here. I think it's a wig. I'm confused. How, why is it such a short hair? scratch that though. Oh, I can use this for some scalp massage type things. Whoever made this, uh, oh my hair, I need a haircut. Whoever made this white Christmas, or what do you call it, elephant Christmas thing is kind of an odd mix here. I had a headache all night since the weather's been changing. As soon as I start streaming, I feel a bit better. But this hair's a mess now. What's happening? This flower seems to be a bit of a baking with wigs theme. It says candied maple bacon. And mind you, I didn't just throw these gifts in here. This was what someone else put together as a white elephant. claims it didn't end up smelling how he had hoped. So I've always liked mug tapping sounds. And those of you who've been here a while know about this is me when I'm clean cut. 
the way that this was like a default offer when I uh, had my school photo for school and they like uh, defaulted it to this zoom like who wants a coffee mug with that close up of your face or your grandson's face or whatever <laughs> is this official instazone merch always liked mug sound. This one I actually got for Christmas. I guess this is more like camping cup. cup, 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 cup. Keep forgetting part of the request was scratching. I guess it's been a while since I've done that in. I personally love scratching and tapping, but I could definitely turn away some of my non-ASMR viewers compared to my role plays, so I won't go too aggressive with it. But yeah. I don't even know what's in this one. so cheap those mugs Jonathan but I think that's how they get you the first couple are cheap and then they up the price oh yeah so this is my gift to one of my best friends hopefully she's not watching she's a close co-worker of mine and She's been um, out on maternity leave, but uh, she's a big, uh, a big Judge Judy fan. So actually, this gift still needs to be given. as cheap and, or not that it was cheap, but as poorly put on as these type. Um, I like the sound of them. Is that what she goes? Oh, she's like a justice now, I see. Here's her folded. Gonna sue me for showing her likeness. Okay, but on to my actual presence. Oh, one more oddity, I guess. Just because I figured this would sound nice. My sister did kind of like a grab bag thing because we weren't really planning on presents but so we all did kind of something small so she had like a just a random bag full of different basically triggers and Michael wound up picking this one You got us some art. Uh, Michael's pretty clear up there. It's supposed to be my name there. It's 
titled The Girl. if it's supposed to be one of our likenesses or a girl I think is what it is so one of my main things I wanted for Christmas was a leaf blower blower and a sucker what do they call it vacuum the mulcher too if we ever want to be good people and take the time to mulch our leaves this was of course the main thing I wanted compared to those very big fancy gifts I've been showing so far could be ASMR if I like put a Tascam microphone outside while I do it. Um, the other big gift that we got, I mean this was more like I don't mind some leaves in our yard and luckily we don't have any giant giant tree that puts an overwhelming amount down but I mostly like this for when other yards leaves blow in blow in and up against their house so you should get those suck those away suck up the big piles and maybe if I get real bored or retired I'll even uh, mulch it and use it in the garden So the other big gift that we got was from my parents and they had heard me say, sorry guys, that we'd like a, uh, a safe, you know, we have one, but like a, a real and big one. Um, so they ordered us one and then it accidentally sent two of them. So now we have two safes. So one will be our gun safe beyond just basically a locked bag and the other one will be uh, you know, for documents and stuff so I'm a bit of a boomer and I make sure I always get calendars for the year Believe it or not, I actually keep up on it. I still need to fill out 2023, so I'm kind of behind, but... I like using calendars. We put it up on the fridge. of a boomer to like to do that. I still do use my um, phone calendar as well. Oh, you know me, Jonathan. I have a whole Google Doc. Those rhinos, is that what that is? Oh, no. <laughs> Bulls. God, they always seem to bring the dog out into the one I'm doing a stream. Okay, but Finally, I also got a bunch of books for Krimbus. Um, my brothers definitely seem to know my taste. And those of you who have watched my streams where I go through my book collection, you'll know this fits right in. There's a hamster in my lunchbox.
I have not, in fact, read it, nor do I recognize this uh, author, but my brother figured I'd like it. He's probably going to be right. Only the most rigorous reading. But one I have read. Hey, Moose. Is, uh, if you haven't, and you like graphic novels for youngsters, Zeta the Space Girl series was top notch. As you see, this is like a brand new copy. Definitely like a uh, sci-fi fantasy Rick and Morty without the vulgarity, I guess. Um, and hey, Jay. Let me see. It's got a lot of good, uh, good drawings in it. But honestly, it was the plot that got me. Uh, and it does become a series as well. I hope everybody had a good week. We only have one, one day. I guess it is technically whisper and vlog time, but I'll wrap up these books here. Now this one, this one I really need to recommend because it went very unnoticed. Um, the problem is there's like a bloody fight scene at the end. And they, uh, this is like a Finnish book originally. Gasp and blood. And so when they translated it to English, I mean, the artwork is undeniably beautiful, and it does look like a youngster on the cover. Um, the thing is, is they marketed it as like a straight-up kid's book. And then, you know, Americans got upset about the violence in it. And it's kind of hard if you're that young. Like, it's kind of higher level. So anyways, they never translated the other ones, so because it went unnoticed, we need as many people reading it now. Plus I love when they have the raised font like this. I remember um, Sideways School always would have that and it like glow in the dark. Told you, it's ASMR day. Not every day is RuneScape. But read Lily the Thief. It's good, like D and D type fantasy. And I guess there was a bit of a theme to the books they got me this year, because a lot of uh, a lot of uh, graphic novels, obviously. Thanks for the follow. Hemo. And it's been a really good week. Kiss my left one, so. Yeah, tomorrow I should do an extra, or even later tonight, an extra Kingdom Hearts stream and some RuneScape this weekend. Saturday, I'm gonna be out of town. This series, I think there's only two in, is excellent. So I definitely would recommend the Lightfall series too. The plot line just builds and builds. Alright, finally, you probably have all heard of the Amulet series. 
And if you haven't read it yet, and you do like graphic novels, I would recommend it. I already have a few of them, so my brothers knew I like it. They still have not finished the damn series. Um, he says he's going to finish it eventually. Yeah, the artwork is just undeniably good. And uh, not really sure how this turned into a book review ASMR, but this is book eight. Yeah, book eight. I think it's also marketed for juvenile, but I'd say the main one. If you're into fantasy, would be to check out Lily the Thief, because it went so unnoticed. Oh, there's one more actually. I, uh, never did graphic novels. I only ever read, like, novel novels. And Amulet series actually was the one. It took me two reads just to comprehend, comprehend what I had read and keep track of the characters, because maybe like you, my mind doesn't really read like that. But I kind of trained it. And now I can even read um, comic books. So my brother got me this because I love Bruce Cavill. I think this is more so a collection of horror stories by multiple authors. But I'll still give it a shot. They definitely know my taste. So yeah, we do ASMR every Thursday, but I do gaming most of my other days of the week. I still can't. I'll have to do a haircut video. So usually for the second half, I take requests for future Thursdays. I switched to whispering. Now I brought a dodgeball from all, uh, from work. I don't really know how this trigger will go, but it does make good scratching. sound, let me know. But a student actually walked up and he doesn't know my Twitch name. But he knows I do ASMR and he said this could be a good sound. And in typical person who doesn't know or say they don't get ASMR, he did it so well. I wish I could impersonate it. that you guys have for role plays or triggers as long as appropriate feel free to put them in chat I still have a good um, a good list of them to go through over time but yeah I usually vlog now too I've been feeling better than earlier in the week I think was more so from the weather changes. And honestly, at 
went away right when I started streaming. some good scratching. are from a book. It's very possible. I like this one. Yeah, it does look like, I think that is from a book. Oh shit. That's why I knew she'd love it. This is like Just a couple more and we'll wrap up so that hopefully I'll have some time for a Kingdom Hearts stream too. I've been playing a 1985 game called Zorro. I assume I might actually do some Kingdom Hearts soon after this, just for like 30 minutes. Otherwise, I 
this for sure. Zoom tomorrow. I'm doing some extra Kingdom Hearts streams. of this. So if you're new here, make sure you tune in on Thursdays for all sorts of different ASMR triggered and streams. On weekends, I just do some extra ones whenever I can. And uh, I uh, do Monday night previous three games. And Tuesday is RuneScape giveaway. I would zoom. In fact, that was my original plan for tonight. Only issue was I wanted to do it while I grind, um, since that's easier to do ASMR. But if you're saying you want that as a request, I could definitely do it as an ASMR 30 minutes on a Thursday. Do it with Kingdom Hearts. Um, we're actually just getting caught up kind of cool. You know, like now I'm about to be as far as I got that time. But yeah, I definitely would. And tonight's might be if we get to Traverse Town so we can train there. And I could do ASMR with it. Um, it's still going the non-ASMR playlist on YouTube, but alright y'all. So hopefully I'll set up for that soon. Keep your eye out if you like watching the gaming ones. Otherwise, next Thursday, I'll be doing another ASMR stream, so... <laughs> 